Listener discretion is advised. So to no one's surprise at the NSA, I also Googled how to cremate a body. Yeah. Yes. And we've Most touched. importantly. We've t- <laughs> Your NSA agent is like, oh, she's probably writing her notes. At it again. <laughs> I'm sure I have like a person posted to my <laughs> like shit to be like, oh, yeah, this bitch again. <laughs> um, so we've touched on these. A lot of these things before, but I will repeat some of the important parts because it's exciting and interesting. So, first of all, God bless Caitlin Doty and her Ask a Mortician YouTube page. I love this bitch. I've read her books. She's oh, incredible. yeah. Mm-hmm. So, if you have any questions about cremation in particular, because she started her career like in a crematory mm-hmm. and it's so fucking fascinating. But mm-hmm. look her up, Caitlin Doty, D O D O U G H T Y. Doty. You gave, you gave me her book. Yeah, I did. So good. Okay, so this is from one of her YouTube videos. Um, so a lot of crematories require a body to be in a container when they're put into the oven, just mm-hmm. because, just so the the operator doesn't have to like handle like a like sliding a body into the oven. Uh huh. Um, So usually these containers are like a cheap pine or a cardboard box, just like something, just like something, you know, cheap gift box. So before they put them in, they remove pacemakers, jewelry, or any artificial parts, like a a fake leg or something, Mm because of course it's going to melt. Pacemakers will explode, Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and it's very dangerous. Not a lot of dental orthodonture, and we Mm. will get to it. And you'll get to it. (laughs) Oh, I will also get to it. (laughs) I love that you interjected with that. Um, Okay, so they will then put a little metal circular tag, like a pet ID tag, like a like a little dog collar thing, Mm -hmm. uh, in with the body, just so they can make sure that they give you the the right right remains. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so we start in the primary chamber. This is like the big oven, the big pizza oven. So this heats up to between 1,800 and 2,000 degrees Fahrenheit. And I know we've talked about before how hot it takes to actually, like, burn body material. Right, right. Do not try this at home. No. It has to get really fucking hot. And also, if you're planning on, like, disposing of a body in your backyard, like in your fire pit, it's not going to get that hot. It's not going to work. No. You, you can't a, you have rely to get on fire. You got to rely on water. Mm. Mm. Well, this is the reason why it took until the mid-1800s for somebody to develop a furnace mm-hmm. hot enough mm. to retain this high of heat for this long of time. Mm-hmm. Because it takes be between... Effective. It takes at least an hour, two hours, maybe more at these high of heats. Of temperatures mm. mm-hmm. to actually break down the body. Sure. So if you think you're going to get rid of a body like in your backyard, dream on. Buster. Stephen Avery. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> oh, God. Leave Stephen out of this. <laughs> Don't want to get into Stephen. Don't email us. Okay. So the primary <sighs> chamber, this is where the body goes. Soft tissues incinerate and vaporize, reducing the body to brittle bones and ash. This takes one to two hours, as I said. And I'll give us now a breakdown of like 10-minute intervals. What happens? So in the first 10 minutes, the muscles, bones, and fat begin to char, sizzle, and shrink. If the body hasn't had a lot of time to decompose very much, um, then there might still be... I. I think it might be the lactic acid. Don't take my word on that. But like if if your body hasn't had that much time to decompose and go through that like rigor mortis, rigor mortis process, then your limbs might contract. Your hands might ball into fists. Your body might hunch forward like your head might go down. Mm. Like you might just kind of ball up. Ooh, and so as Caitlin addresses, I think there's a like a like a rumor that they like sit up inside the oven. They don't oh, sit. They don't no, sit up. No, they no. just. But they, they just like. They no, just like no, kind of no. ball. They just kind of ball forward. Got it. Don't like it. No, nobody no. sits up. Don't worry about it. Do not like that. No. <laughs> no, well, do don't worry because it's not a thing. Good because I don't like. It. I don't like that. <laughs> Um, around 20 minutes, soft tissue has been burned off around the face and the skull, 
your cheeks might remain just because your cheeks are the fattest part of your face. My cheeks would remain. <laughs> your your cheeks would remain. <laughs> I feel right. like your forehead might remain. My too. forehead. Your, eye, not your going eyebrows anywhere. would remain. Yeah. <laughs> Mm-hmm. So your ribs are beginning to show, and also my favorite part: jets of liquid might begin to spray from your abdomen area. Good God! From tears in the cavity as the abdominal organs dehydrate and the liquids are aggressively evaporating. So, like your your cool, innards cool, are cool, so cool, cool, hot cool, 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 cool. Mm-hmm. that all your liquids are they're steaming. They're going to shoot out. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. don't know that I was prepared for this. And no, I was not. I, I know have that been. I was not prepared. <laughs> because I know you and I know the topic. And so you I weren't prepared. Sh- and I want to be cremated, but this is like <laughs> alarming. I Oh, it, well, it gets worse. So if great. you gotta tune out, go now. Pew, pew, pew. Well, I sure hope you liked that clip. If you did like that clip, make sure you are subscribing to our YouTube channel, leaving us a nice review, and joining us on Patreon for even more video content, audio content, salacious content all around. Come join us. Treat yourself.